Happening today, the governors of New York and New Jersey will hold events to mark the 10th anniversary of Superstorm Sandy. As we approach one decade since the devastation, work is underway to protect neighborhoods from future storms. Eyewitness News reporter Janice Yu is live at Rockaway Beach with more on this. Good morning, Janice. Good morning, Michelle. Yeah, the work is actually underway right now. We can see some of the equipment uh, moving here behind me on the beach. So this is actually part two of the federally funded project. And the goal here is to create a 250 foot wide beach along seven miles. Now this area a decade ago was unrecognizable. Uh, the 10 foot storm surge took out homes and businesses, reducing them to piles of rubble. Now the boardwalk was destroyed and there were millions of dollars worth of damage left behind. Uh, the contractors for the Army Corps of Engineers are replacing about seven miles of the shoreline, putting more sand on the beach and building more durable dunes by driving sheet pilings into the ground and then covering them with sand. Now, part one of this project was building out stone structures to protect the beach from erosion. The entire project is expected to wrap up in 2026, but not everyone agrees the project is worth the 350 million dollar price tag. It's a temporary, it's a, it's a band-aid on a problem. I mean, we we have a serious climate change problem. Uh, we're, we're going to get and are getting more intense storms. We are getting and, and it's going to get much worse accelerated sea level rise. The Army Corps of Engineers, along with city leaders, will be talking later today uh, to discuss in more detail about the projects that are going on and the progression. In addition, Governor Kathy Hochul will be in the far Rockaways to commemorate the 10-year anniversary.